believe it. So, do you want to fight? Uh, not, not me, just in general. For dead sec. Hey? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Nice. Uh, so now it's, I think we're going to have to switch with him. Yeah, it says meet him at the pub, I guess. Do that in a second. What is the bio for this guy? 33, a hacker. Uh, destroyed news drones. Nice. Why do these unavailable? Available. Weird. I don't know why it's doing that. I get the guy that's available one, but the other one's kind of weird. All right, let's fast travel to the safe house and then we'll just walk out from there. Okay, nice. And now we can just walk through here, which we'll get another loading scene, but it'll only be a second or two. Non-lethal tranquilizer weapons can cause enemies to become unconscious after being shot. The effective is instantaneous on a headshot. The dead sec resurgence have nice. prompted Parliament to approve the what? use of lethal force for Albion contractors. CEO Nigel Cass had this Oh no, it better dead not fully reset. Find that Albion, unlike the police force of this city, is battle tested and proven in the field. The Prime Minister's office has called this shoot to kill mandate a drastic but necessary Great timing, yeah? Here, in your optic. So there's no turning back, huh? Say goodbye to normal life and become a bleeding outlaw. Normal? Normal like Albion gunning people down in the street? I know it's all gone to shit, but it's still my life. Tough to just walk away. No, look, you're just making sure that the things you care about have a world to be safe in. <laughs> I will say that the two, these two guys are probably some of the best voice actors Fine. I've had so far. All right, I'm in. Welcome to the resistance. I hope his entire outfit did not change though. I did see people complaining about outfits right. resetting. Welcome aboard, etc. etc. No! I'll give you the speech later. Right now we need you and your big strong <laughs> friend to get on top of SRSHQ it did. and steal a server. Think you can handle that? Oh, there's another the operator. Heading there now. Really? Dude, for real? Ah, oh, that sucks. Ah. <sighs> The outfit's reset. <laughs> Don't mind me. I think the visuals is okay. I mean, it, the first mission uh, showed it a lot better, but I feel like for as ambitious as the game is, it's like, I don't know. I get it. I don't mind it though. <laughs> the gameplay and the story is what really matters for me, really. Yeah, no, I get that. C comparing it to, I mean, if you look at, um, what, like Breakpoint? I feel like Breakpoint was even a. Uh, a pretty big step for some of the cutscenes and stuff they were really good cutscenes but then again I wonder if it's because um, since you can play as anybody in this game it's not like they can lock it down I'll highlight the server with the AR and everything's randomly generated to so you'll need to use a heavy cargo drone to steal it Oh, 
summon a cargo drone. Where did you go? Uh, there it is. Summoned AI rendered or something. Yeah, that's that's got to be like one of the big reasons. Now, like thinking about that because use a cargo to steal the server. Okay, so I need to jump on top of this. Give me a ride. Because they don't have like fully uh, everything's AI. Most likely they don't have like full like voice actors or actor uh, motion cap, like facial recognition and everything. For the most part. Just magically stealing the their server. Build a server to the truck. This is a pretty cool mission. I really like the fact that it seems like we're actually going to get um, like missions that say like, okay, use a somebody who has this outfit and do X Y Z. Now do this. Uh, this mission with this outfit and do xyz you know all right vehicles loaded so you're all set now don't drive like a sodding nutter keep that thing in one piece blood i'm like the best driver ever watch the ar constructed test CTOS AR. Data reconstruction in progress. This will do. Remain in the area until I've downloaded enough data to the server. Download complete. I need a wider sample of data, so I'm pushing you the coordinates to a new location. Deliver the truck to the Buckingham Palace. This is brilliant. Look at this. It's compiling data from the surveillance infrastructure. Nearby CTOS drones, civilian optics, CCTV, and then it assembles those scraps into what happened in this location 24 hours ago. Fantastic. That is so loud. Not a big fan of the characters, but to play, uh, but it's refreshing, I guess. It, I think it's really cool for, for being able to choose anybody. Um, personally, I, I usually prefer, like a, a game where it puts you in somebody who's been fully developed, like they develop over time as well, and that all that good stuff. Um, so like usually that's my preference but for like a game that you can play as anybody it's like in my opinion like the perfect uh sandbox where you can do anything you can be anybody um and i think when online comes that it's going to be a lot of fun for that CTOS AR data reconstruction in progress. All right, so that I get. Optics, CTOS cameras, <laughs> Especially because like laptops, they want to stay discreet, and shag. there's so many Fucking like electrical light up, shag. like oh, all this shit. weird stuff now, that you can well, get shit. as clothing. You like I like keeping it basic, you know. Or overshare something personal. Whatever you do, just get to the last location <laughs> in one piece. Motherfucker. All right, cool. Transfer complete. I'm missing one last data set. Pushing you the coordinates to the nice. location now. Auto drive now enabled. Auto drive now disabled.
I wish you could do auto drive and just uh, speed up. the sub subtitles for the last person. Watch out, Albion. Oh, God. I mean, nah, fam, you gotta make it beat. There it is. Wait, ah, they want me to deliver it in there. I thought they wanted me to get out right here. I keep came out again. They're late. got to be something that can help you uh, keep it in place. Uh, get out the vehicle. Oh boy, what happened here? There's a bunch of blood. Whoa! Our banks are hot shape, these fucks! The drones destroy the server before I'm done. Get out of the lorry and take care of them. Shoot them. Throw rocks at them. Destroy them psychologically with cyberbullying. Just keep them busy <laughs> until the transfer's complete. I will say the uh, pink gun is pretty nice. Got it. I won't hesitate to shoot them. Help, please. Ah! All right, I've got it. <laughs> now, can't lug around this server forever. We should probably wipe our prints off it anyway. I'm listening. I'll overload the CPUs to cause a power spike and destroy the battery unit. The electromagnetic pulse should destroy both the server and the drones. So, you know, run. Oh boy. Ah! EMP blast imminent. Uh... Well, that was fun, wasn't it? We pulled off a heist, made life a bit harder for the tyrants of the world. And nice. most importantly, I got a new toy to play with. Now, run along back to the safe house. Sabine wants you and your new teammates for a briefing. Okay. Attend the team meeting. Not a bad back back. <laughs> I'm not gonna wear it on this guy, but I wanted to get it for my hacker. Okay, let's uh attend the team meeting. Answer the call. Oh, ho, ho.
Let's switch to this guy. Just in case there's like audio, like chatting and stuff. Okay, so it does keep the outfits that you create for them. What should we do today? But, I. Uh, but when you go into the cutscenes and stuff, it changes it back. Hopefully, they they add something where it lets them keep the outfits or something. Oh, that's not bad. <laughs> well done, team. It's good to see the safe house filling up again. The only way we're going to keep I wonder if they the just put in the the most recent the characters you used. We need to recruit, train, build back our arsenal. The people are itching to rise up and take their city back. We just need to show them that dead sec are fighting along with them. Sure, but can't we just take all the assholes out and ta-da, problem solved. There was a word for Albion back in my day. It started with an end and ended with a Nazi. Don't forget uh -huh. about Clan Kelly. Them fucks have way too much power. I got beef with them. Fair, but remember that this zero day hacker group is. I still hate out that voice there. actor, I gotta say. Once, and it's a good bet they'll try again. I believe they were responsible for the bombings and framed dead sec. With your help, I plan to get to the bottom of this mystery. I'd say that's a full docket. Enough talk. Let's unfuck London. I gotta say that was kind of like one of those meetings that you, that your boss has, but it could have been an email. <laughs> it's like, do we really need to bring everyone together for this? Coming up to. D I found a lead that may help us unravel more about Zero Day and the bombings we ate shit for. I picked up an encrypted signal from the Tone Conference site that's been broadcasting on a loop since the night of the bombing. Go investigate. You might even get to try out that fancy new AR tech we stole. I mean, creatively shared. I need uh, somebody that gets more money. Because right now we have like no operators that bring in money. Coming up in. Find the source of the tone attack site. Somebody that either gambles or somebody else that uh, just brings more money in in general, uh, in investors, something. I'm gonna look around for somebody. Earns more ETO randomly. Uh, Where's the area that I have liberated? Okay, so Camden. Uh, is there a bar or something in Camden? I'm, gonna, I'm also gonna check my people. Um, just somebody that brings in more money. I'm gonna recruit them before we do the next mission. That's nice. Nice to see you again. Hmm. Okay, let's see it in here. Clothing discount randomly buys clothes. No. Clothes, no. Medical, no. No. I 
I wish there was a way like you could, I don't know, like search the area for somebody. Shock rifle? That's pretty sick. But she may die permanently. Ooh. Fuck me. This one profile just says hitman. Professional that hitman. That's so cool. Okay. That train station you just traveled to is where I first met Magnar. Really? <laughs> That's pretty cool. <laughs> this one? Houston Station. That's actually really neat. She's got an AK. She can dance. <laughs> That's where the trains go uh, up north go. Okay. Nice. It's actually pretty sick. Everyone in this district is easier to recruit. But I can't find anybody that has some sort of... Uh... Come on, there's got to be somebody. Is there like a financial district up here? Then Victoria Station near Buckingham Palace is where we first met Hank. <laughs> Wait. He's got a car, but it's a gambling addict. Oh, that's the first time I've I've got somebody like this. Cool. Here we go. Activist. That's pretty on brand for us, right? I really wanted to get the rally people to fight ability. How easy is he to recruit? What's his name? Bruce Ballin. Financial district is the city of London borough. So in this area. Yeah, that makes sense. I, I haven't really gone over there. Maybe What's I'll go check that out. It seems there's an arrest warrant out on him and a bounty on his head with the Kellys. And he's been catfished three times by his aunt. How <laughs> does someone even make that many enemies? Good question. You could dig around and see what turns up. That's where the Bank of England is and the stock exchanges are. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to go check that out then. Hey, man, you're going to be uh, recruited eventually. Okay, so in this area. Digging up the past. Okay, so that's the that one I see. Sabotage. I could go do this, knock this out, and then drive around uh, financial district. I'm just trying to focus on getting somebody that makes money in the background now. So that way, like as I'm running other missions, um, well, at least have somebody that's like gathering <laughs> more money. Cause right now I'm like broke and every time I want to buy stuff, I can't. <laughs> so many people. All right. Oh, they want me to go all the way up there. Oh man. I don't know if I'm going to do that right this second then. Okay. So do we know where the, the bank is? Like which area? I'm going to go to the center. Auto drive now enabled. It like automatically stopped the car. Do 
You're with the big cathedral, if I remember correctly. Earn more ETL. Auto drive now disabled. Does she dislike? Okay, so she doesn't mind people. Right next to you. Is that it? Oh, bank. <laughs> bank of England. Alright, I'm gonna put save her as a secondary. Building a protest, protesting outside of. Okay. So since we're right in this area, now I'm gonna start looking for those people, uh, investors and stuff. It's a nice bike, but I think I'm better off on foot. Oh wait, that's a cop. Deportation officer. I need a cop because I haven't got one yet. Fully auto shock gun. All right, after this corner, I'm going to turn around. Not going to spend too much time, but if I can find somebody that's good, as in they make money, earn more ETL, economist Catherine Moran. <laughs> oh, he has the stat. I'm on my to be looking at an Albion deck for recruitment right now. Might be quite nice to have someone on the inside, you know? Wait, what was that? Oh, well, we already have somebody that's Albion. I think that's what he just said, right? Yeah, we have this guy. Yeah. Who's she? Oh, she's a cop too, and she has I'm a stun gun. A police constable in the wild. Its natural enemies include Albion, Clan Kelly, and, when threatened, Death Sec. <laughs> There's another one. Damn, there's so many cops around here. What the hell? They're everywhere. Is there like a police station or something? Broker. That, uh, the older lady. about the law and shit. You think they could kind of help me out with a cat-based custody issue? Ironically, running an illegal resistance group would be easier if we had someone to consult for legal advice. <laughs> I'm pretty sure we have a lawyer. Blockchain specialist. <laughs> Watch you want. Oh, there's a lot of people here. All right, let's see. No, nope. 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 I want to find somebody that has... A earn more C or ETO and uh, gambles. He gambles, but she also hate doesn't like this dead sec.
medical uniform guy. Shorter injury time. I'm gonna tag him. Just in case. Wrench. They, they said the, the use of VPNs and other private is an offense or something like that. Okay, lady. Whoa. Wait. There's a family member of somebody right here. Whoa. Get out of there. Run, run, run. Didn't think so. Holy shit. Extra melee damage. I wouldn't recruit her, but she's the lover of Adam. Who's Adam? Oh, is that the guy I'm playing as? Oh, that's it. <laughs> that's his lover. <laughs> that's funny. All right, there's got to be. Come on, somebody right here. None of you are rich. Oh, snap. Whoa. Wait, suspect of what? Operative El Rubius rescued their rival. Wait, but why do they not like fleeing from Lawrence White? Unless if they're saying that they like, um, wait, will they actually say anything to each other? You can instantly recruit her? <laughs> nah, I'm not going to. So how do you uh, rate this game so far? Uh, for as far as a rating, personally, I'd give it like a, um, like an eight, eight or nine, honestly. I, I really like it though. Um, I really like the like freedom that you have the choice to do whatever you want be whoever you want the only thing that i think that they need to add on is wait i think that guy actually was there's injury eh. um is like a little bit more customization options and then uh just like manual saves and some like um basically i i feel like they just need to add more uh like quality of life features like that kind of stuff. Oh, what's this? ETO, fast downloads. Right now I'm trying to find somebody that uh that makes uh makes money so that way like while I'm running other missions uh we're getting more money and stuff. Trying to decide, decide if I should buy it. Uh, I would say if you really like like open world games, you like like sandbox stuff. Um, things like that, then I highly recommend it. If you like like GTA Online without like the super repetitiveness, if you like even honestly just GTA in general. Um, and then also like when multiplayer drops later on I think it's going to add a lot to it as well so with all of that and then the option of it's it's just like the, the perfect RPG sandbox style game plus add in hacking and that's what this is so if that sounds cool to you I highly statue, recommend it the last truly uncompromised art form I suppose Deadset could always get into basking. I can think of worse side hustles. 
but I also know that it can be a, a hard choice if you want to pick it up or not. Um, the other thing I will say though is if you're on PC, um, Ubisoft Plus, that's how I'm currently playing it. It's only 15 bucks. And then if you really decide to buy it, you can buy it. But uh, also, so long as you keep your subscription, then you'll uh, have access to it. And you get the ultimate edition of it. So like season pass and all that good stuff. If you really want to. That's the one thing I highly recommend if it's not something that... Uh, if it's something you're not sure about. And also, the cool thing is... Since Assassin's Creed comes out shortly, um, if you really want to as well, anybody that does sub for uh, Ubisoft Plus, then when Assassin's Creed drops, you'll also be getting that, which is really neat. Uh, she dislikes them. She, are, we already have her mission. Earns more ETO. Uh, she's not gonna be worth it, so let me abandon hers. Dislikes. Professional hitman. I'm gonna get rid of this guy. Get rid of this guy. I think there are so many games coming out in the next two months yeah my big games personally are like this and uh the team injury release um and assassin's creed but with ubisoft plus i actually get you get both of them which is nice do i go for the her or do i go for her uh, he gives me shorter rest times in general. I feel like I need to find somebody that just has extra, just generates more. Somebody, please. There's got to be somebody. Whoa. Wait, sister of Mary Sheehan? Who's that? Mary. Mary Sheehan, her. My bloody ears. Where do you think you're going? Leave her alone. Ah! Oh, God. Oh, my God. Ah. Getting beat up. All right. Run. No. Ah, rested. No. That was my best hacker. <laughs> Damn. All right, Jim Gordon. I'm swapping to you because you're like broken for some reason. Oh, and he gives shorter arrest time, so hopefully you won't, uh, my best hacker won't be arrested for too long. Your somewhat reckless teammate has got themselves <laughs> thrown in the old clink, I'm afraid. It's a model. Difficult to resist oppression from behind bars. It will be a while before they're available. Pro tip, however, why not recruit a barrister to the team? I mean, no one exactly likes a barrister, but they do have their function. They should be able to shorten the jail time of imprisoned operatives. Hmm. Oh, wait, we have one. But who's this? <gasps> oh, my. I feel like a spell has been put on me. A professional hypnotist. Looks like someone never updated their career goals from when they were a child. Just uh, updated for. Whoa, now we have a lot of people that it keeps suggesting us. Cool. 
Just arrested operators out of jail faster. In 1853. <laughs> Still looking for that one person that can make me some more money. I mean, he could, but... I guess it's better... Wait. Wait a second. Wait, I'm playing as the guy that was arrested. What? Dude, what is going on right now? He's arrested for 29 minutes, but look. I'm playing as him. But the game thinks that I'm playing as him. What is going on? Also, what happened? Wait, what happened to my operator? My other guys? All right, hold on. Let me restart the game. Because something weird is going on, dude. Yet, I'm also missing the other two, uh, the three pre-order operatives as well. So something is def definitely going on. Dude, I don't know if it's right now. So this logo means that it's saving, but usually when that happens, it like causes like right now it's it's like frozen. Like it's not doing anything. It's moving, but it's still saving. All right, hold on. I'm going to run to the bathroom. One sec. <laughs> 